Hello guys, my name is Aaron. So here we are back at the Minecraft user guide series. And first and foremost, happy Father's Day for all the fathers who is watching this video right now. And so here we are. I'm going to go down to the mob farm and I'm going to have to show you a thing that I have didn't have showed before. So you can see I have died here a couple of times and all of my diamond gear just has been taken by all of these villagers these zombie villagers so I am going to put a video on curing them pretty soon because I have almost all of the ingredients except some of the ingredients to make a fermented spider eye and some of those so so I'm gonna go all the way till the top and today's goal is to get set a new crop farm a bigger scale I have made the foundation for it so here it is so this area is going to be my crop farm and that area over there that I have didn't build yet is going to be my tree farm and I'm gonna build it right now with you guys I have made kind of this partition thingy that is not really useful but it kinda looks better I'm gonna build this entire area and I'll be back after that so here we are back guys and I have made the foundation for it and as you can see I have I'm gonna just tear down this tree and if you might be wondering how I'm gonna get all of the dirt to build this farm if you did not know you can make chorus dirt by using some gravel and some normal dirt so I can take that sugar cane away and if I can just take some normal dirt and use it in a crisscross pattern I think so I think so you need one more stack so you you need to do it in a in this formation and you get one four cores that by putting all four of this and you get about four stacks for all of that and you cannot use directly it because it is named as chorus dirt and it is kind of different than normal dirt you have to take another have to make a hoe for it I'm going to just make a hoe real quick Think so I have some sticks here and I'm gonna make a hoe why not I make some couple more because I'm gonna make some so much chorus normal dirt right now so how do we make it is a simple process by making some hoe you can just place some normal dirt and if you hoe it it will go back to normal dirt so I'm going to get all these four stacks hold and get back to normal dirt then I'll be back after that so guys I have converted all four stacks of chorus dirt into normal dirt and you do not want to know how hard it was it almost took over four or oh, this is the fourth one fourth or the third hoe and this is the third stone shovel that I used to mine and I had a long time and after about 30 minutes or so I have done it and I'm gonna place it about I think so two three three blocks apart from each other I'm gonna mostly make the tree farm bigger because the tree farm is better I do not need food right now because I can die anytime and regenerate my entire health bar almost there and that's it oh our clip on the way that I can hear so guys as you can see I am placing all of the dirt blocks that I have mined I have converted all four stacks and you you do not want to know how long it took and how much 
resources it took to do this but I have done it at last and I am going to make the tree farm bigger and make the crop farm a little smaller and this is enough but I am going to just make it a little bit bigger or smaller according to the time so I am going to just place the blocks it's nothing going to be automated or something right now it is big enough but I am going to not make it automatic all I am going to just make it a normal <laughs> a normal farm and I am going to extend it a little more back so that it gets 4 by 4 on the back so that I get 8 trays growing at the same time I might just extend the back of this a little more so I'm going to just make another row right here and break the last block that I do not read right now so I'm going to take this center block off I'm going to make a, another infinite water source oh, another here and I'm going to just So if I start hoeing this entire field or else I could do the efficienter way of doing it. This could hydrate about one, two, third block here, fourth block there. It could hoe all the way till one, two, three, four and one okay so I can just do it over here so I can just take this guy out and place it a normal grass block so that I could get enough I think so it goes all over the area I'm going to just hold it all the way because I do not want to just calculate all the places it could go so I can just hold this much I do know that it will go all the way till here so I'm going to just place some more of the dirt blocks and I'm going to try my best to not fall down and increase my platform I just tell it a bit more so that I could be a little more safer next time around so guys after I place and hydrate all the blocks I'll be after that so guys here we are I have made the entire platform bigger and I have made entire thing and I have placed all the seeds alternating row all of these are between melons and pumpkins and these are all about this is only sugarcane but these all are I think so these three are potatoes these three are carrots and these three over this row is some normal what you'll say the wheat seeds then this is the tree farm I have occurred a small problem here guys the problem is that the leaves are intersecting here and I might not get the best enough sapling drops but that is an easy fix by just moving just a little bit left or right and that's done and already I have got about one two three four five six six trees in this area and I have moved all of my storage here and I'll I'm gonna make the passive mob farm over there or over the next district I'm gonna like to make in a district farm so this is my crop farm all the vegetation stuff so this is my tree farm this is my crop farm then I'm gonna just follow here this is gonna be my kelp farm I'm not gonna build it right now because I do not have any kelp so here is going to be my new and only uh, passive mob farm so yeah and 
hope you like this video subscribe to my channel and like this video for more and till the next video stay tuned guys it has been Aaron place and I am out